Hey yo y'all, here again with another review. But this trip is handmade from a company named Designs by Rachel Beth, where they make a lot of watercolor sets, usually with a theme to each set. This is me just showing off how they did their packaging with their logo with the sticker, and me struggling to get the stuff out with one hand while recording this as I show off their card, which was a thank you note. And then the other stuff like the watercolors plus the free samples they gave. The set I picked out was That's My Jam, which was themed out to be for jellies or jams that you put on sandwiches. It comes with, um, kind of the primary colors. I should say because I'm under neon lights, the colors are going to look totally different. Here's the free sample dot card by the way. After unwrapping one pan, you can see it came with a magnet that was an option plus her logo and the name of the colors. And slowly but surely, I just wet the colors so I could swatch them into my watercolor sketchbook. They react to water very quickly. I like the fact that each set that she makes comes with these little swatchy cards so you could actually see the colors in each set if you were to take it to travel. I'm about to show off the colors in a natural light the next day, which is coming right about now. See, these are how the colors look under sunlight. I also did swatches of how you will mix all the colors together. And here's the artwork I'm going to use with my OC Rosé bought to eat a hamburger. And as you see, I started just laying down a basic color for the background because I wasn't going to go all detailed with the background. The purpose is to see how well these paints layered and mixed to each other, so you, if you could take it as like a primary set or not. Like, you see me making skin tone from the Lady M and Raspberry Burnt. And this is just me laying her on top of each other, blending it out and add in little things I will usually do with watercolors as I normally paint. The only problem for me is that the waters kind of granulate. Like for example, if the colors just makes a different tone or color entirely when dried, which has happened a few times, but at the same token, I really didn't care because it kind of made the picture look really cool with a different effect to it. Overall, would I recommend this set? Yes, if you want to just support small businesses and if you want a little tiny set with primary colors, not as the standard primary colors, for your own painting purposes to go out with. Here's the painting so far, and I hope you have a wonderful day. Thank you.